Hey everyone, it's Evangeline here at eTrailer, and today we're taking a look at the Rocky Mounts Guide Rail 2x Platform Rack and how it fits on the 2018 Audi S5. This is a quick test fit if you want to look into the in-depth specs, features, measurements, check out my full review video here at eTrailer.com. But first and foremost, as for this bike rack with this vehicle, it's super sleek, super sporty, super fast, and I'm not just talking about the car. The guide rail really shines with putting the bike on and taking the bike off without too much time, stress, or pressure. Another really cool thing is that you are able to open up the trunk without having to tilt the rack away. I have longer handlebars here, and I still have plenty of space between the trunk and those handlebars and those pedals, but if I needed to grab something even larger, I can just pull this lever here, tilt the bike rack away with the bikes on, grab what I need, and lift it back up, and it snaps into place. Another thing that's really cool is the stadium design of the rack. You can see how there's plenty of ground clearance from the bottom of the rack to the ground, and even more further out. With the Audi being a shorter vehicle and the hitch even lower, that helps out a lot with that. You also have locks, you have keys, you have a huge chain lock to protect your investment. Where it really shines is taking the bike off. See these bright blue levers here? We'll just pull that. One, right there, and then two over here. And once those are released, you can then just push out one and two and just like that you are now ready to hit the trails and go for a bike ride that front and rear wheel mount design is super fun and easy to use and having those levers in place means you don't have to be reaching too far out to disengage your bike from the bike rack also notice how the trays are designed with those little grooves that way you can slide your bikes back and forth with a maximum wheelbase of 55 inches, plus those different grooves for those different tire widths. The maximum tire width of this is gonna be up to three inches. And you hear how it starts clicking all the way out. That means you can slide your bikes back and forth in case you have issues with handlebars running into saddles or pedals running into the other bike. So you can check and see with that in the lock position. It starts ratcheting down, meaning you can now store it away. Now, speaking of storage, this actually has a compact position. You pull on this lever again, but this time you lift up on the rack. It snaps into place into the folded position. Again, you can still open up your trunk with it in the folded up position. Where it sits, your taillights will still be visible past the bike rack since it sits right underneath the top tray and your backup camera sits at the very top though so what is going to happen is you will have all this space of view behind the backup camera you will see the bike rack but you'll also still be able to kind of see the cars and the view behind you but you have full visibility through your rear window if that's going to be a major issue so very quick test fit we were able to see how it fits on our car we saw how it gave us a little extra ground clearance we had full access to our trunk and for bikes of different shapes and sizes whether you have a 60 pound electric bike a really wide wheelbase mountain bike or a carbon fiber frame bike this can carry those types of bikes a similar bike rack you may want to consider would be the kuat nv if you have heavier bikes and you want to use a ramp but with how low this is to the ground i don't think you need a ramp at all to lift those bikes onto the Rocky Mount Guide Rail. So right here, right now, this was a look at the Rocky Mount Guide Rail 2-Bike Platform Rack on a 2018 Audi S5.